Welcome back, guys. Well, I'm upset because last time I played Wrestling Empire, which was a couple days ago, Seth Rollins interfered in my match against Shinsuke Nakamura, and he caused me the loss at almost the very beginning. That, that was a pay-per-view match, too. So today, I'm probably going to get some revenge and hopefully get signed to a promotion. So we're going to find out what happens. And by the way, if you're not subscribed, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Uh, you got nothing to lose, really. So let's get to it. All right, we're starting things off with a War versus Seth Rollins team. I'm getting really weak. I started off with some pretty, pretty good stats. And now they're just, you know, getting less and less as time goes on. But, you know, I'm still able to hold my own. I made the game harder, so I'm losing a lot more matches, but that's okay. That's how you're supposed to play the game. It turns out winning all your matches is kind of detrimental to your career. It kind of hurts you in a way. So you got to kind of balance it out a little bit. And so putting on hard mode, I think, is definitely the way to go. So let's get to it. All right, so Seth Rollins has Super Tiny and someone else. Let's see, you made the biggest mistake of your career by interfering in my business, Seth Rollins. You should be grateful that I even showed up to one of your matches because no one else wants to. Uh, you better hope somebody shows up for you tonight because we're about to see how tough you really are. Oh, okay. Oh, it's just a two-on-two -two war. So it's Seth Rollins and Super Tiny. And I've got... I don't know who that is. But it looks like Seth Rollins is going after me. Oh wait, is Super Tiny on my team? Maybe Super Tiny's on my team. <laughs> no, Su Super Tiny's not on my team. I don't know why that guy was attacking me. I'm actually not doing too bad right now. Come on, Seth. Let's come outside. I'm gonna go after Super Tiny. Oh, maybe not. <laughs> maybe I'll keep going after Seth. Oh, and Seth Rollins just... Hurricane Ron is me outside the ring. I would not get up just like that if I took a fall from that far up. <laughs> Sorry. Out on the concrete. On, straight onto your back. Let's see if I can German suplex him back into the ring. Yep. <laughs> it's always fun. Oh, cool. I get a double handed choke slam outside the ring. Oh, and I couldn't. You know, proportionally, they should be a lot bigger compared to the ring, but that's okay, because the ring is huge compared to them. All right, RKO. Oh, what? I have adrenaline, and he reversed it? That's weird. There we go. I'm pretty sure I can pin here. Yep. One, two, three. All right. Seth Rollins is gone. Now it's time to get super tiny out of there. Which should be pretty easy. Let's see if we can get him with a submission. Come on, give up. You're too tiny to hold on. He'll give up here. Maybe not. Oh, he's got to give up now. I've, I've got them all rolled up. I'm hurting him pretty good. And he's so tiny that I've got him completely encompassed. It's insane. Oh, and he reversed it. And then I reversed him. Yeah, this is almost over. He is so tiny. I made a character with the maximum height, too, so it's pretty interesting to see them next to each other. Let's just see if I can pin him. Ah, oh, no. Not yet. Super Tiny's pretty resilient. Oh, and he hit me with a bat. Release German. Alright, now let's go for the pin. I bet you he'll be done now. Yeah, a lot of people can't take my release German suplex. Simon Lamont, okay, that's who that is. I was like, who is my partner? I don't know who that is. Super Tiny suffered, Seth Rollins suffered. Simon Lamont's status has not been affected because he didn't really do anything. And I've reached the limit of wrestling school, uh, like always. All right, Hi Yakuza has been released by Maple Leaf, and this now make ends meet on the independent circuit. Tiger Mask is glad that Hi Yakuza is gone. Psychosis has been released by Maple Leaf. Wow, they're just letting go of everybody. Kurt Angle defeated Sting to become the new cruiserweight champion of Super Lucha Libre. That's pretty funny. 
X-Pac has left Federation Online to pursue a career at Super Lucha Libre. That's good for him. William Regal is sad that X-Pac left Federation Online. Aw, they must be friends. Ken Ryu has left Federation Online to pursue a career at Super Lucha Libre. All Cobain's feud with Jacob Adams lost momentum. Yeah, again, don't remember having a feud. Magnum TA's attitude has deteriorated considerably in recent weeks. Rising Sun Pro Riso have overtaken Wrestling Revolution to become the most popular brand of wrestling. All right, looks like I'm in a guest partner street fight versus Buttermunk's team. Buttermunk's still bitter over me beating him all the time. Bitter Buttermunk. So let's do it. Let's see who my guest partner for this street fight is. Oh, first it's Buttermunk and don't know who that is. We'll find out. Versus me and... Oh, I have to announce who my partner is when I come out. That's cool. Oh, I can't wait to find out. This is exciting. Who's my partner going to be? I feel I might need someone special to help me get the job done tonight, so I hope you like the surprise I have in store. Who is it? It's Kevin Owens with Paul Heyman. Nice. From Federation Online. It is really good to have Kevin Owens on your team. For sure. Heck yeah, Kevin Owens. Yeah, let's embrace. We're going to do this. That's a really close hug, too. Oh, it's a one-on-one -on -one street fight? Oh, that's Gorilla Monsoon. Well, if it's a street fight you want, it's a street fight you shall get. I love nailing him with the chair. All right, from the top. Oh, and he caught me. That was awesome, actually. <laughs> Not good for me, but awesome for him. Alright, yeah, let's get back in the ring. Problem with using weapons is you can't build up your special meter. Your adrenaline meter. Oh, wow. Gorilla, plus, gorilla Press Slam, like Gorilla Monsoon would do. Oh, yeah, Kevin Owens can't do anything if I don't tag him in. Another, oh, he tried a Gorilla Press Slam, it went awry. He's kind of taking it to me right now. He is definitely a lot stronger than I am, it looks like. Me being 5'8", and I guess 200, or 300 something pounds. Alright, Kevin Owens. Let's do this. Why did Kevin Owens fall off the thing? Alright, come on. Oh, I like that Kevin Owens has that running clothesline. That's really awesome. I'm so used to the back move being the released German suplex. Not this surprise roll-up pin thing that he doesn't even pin with. Are there no pins in this? I, I guess I didn't see what kind of match... Oh, it's a street fight. That's right. Just gotta knock him out. There are no pins. Just beating them down until they're gone. I wonder if it's elimination. Because Gorilla Monsoon's about to be knocked out. <laughs> oh yeah, it is elimination. Alright, Buttermunk. Come on in. Let's see if I can tag Jacob Adams back in. There we go. Alright, Buttermunk. Nice. Love throwing him out of the ring like that. It's so cool. Alright. Since this is a street fight, you gotta use weapons. Kevin Owens beating down Buttermunk on the outside, which he's allowed to do. I'm just going to hit him over and over with the chair until he's done for. I am a heel, so I should be using weapons a lot more. That's what heels do. Yeah, Buttermunk's done. We got it. We got it. Gorilla Monsoon's profile suffered. Buttermunk's profile suffered. Kevin Owens has not been affected, and I've... Significant. Oh, my profile's improved significantly. That's awesome. So I got more popularity and attitude. Sweet. All right, Rikishi has defeated Shawn Michaels to become the new U.S. champion. Wade Barrett and Dr. Dash have defeated Just Incredible and Goldust to become the new tag team champions of Maple Leaf. Lita has left Super Lucha Libre to go to All American. Polka Paulo and Bubba Ray have defeated Kenny Omega and Nacho Libre to become the tag team champions of Federation Online. Brandy Rhodes has defeated Kylie Barrier to become the new co-ed champion of wrestling school. Lots of title changes. David Schultz has left wrestling school to pursue a career at All-American. 
Hi, Yakuza has left wrestling school to pursue a career at Rising Sun. When am I going to leave wrestling school? Oh, maybe right now. Your buddy, the great Muta, suggested that you might like to join us at Rising Sun. You might not be as valuable as you used to be, I guess. I guess it's because of my age. Let's see, $47,000, no money per week, without a clause. Somebody suggested to me if you try to do the ironclad, but if I do a positive clause, I'm going to have to take my advance down probably to 30000 Let's see if this works. This way I don't have to... Yeah, I guess that does work. That way I don't have to do any crazy, stupid things. I won't get paid every week. But that's okay. I have almost $3 million, so I think I can get by for 25 weeks without making any money. All right, so our first match in Rising Sun, we're taking on Tito Santana's team. Let's do this. Me and the Great Muta, tag team partners. I hope I'm still a heel. Taking on Tito Santana and Mick Foley. All right, great. You know, I've met Mick Foley before. He is... Really cool. The great Muta and I have joined forces to become even greater than the sum of our parts. All the other teams in Rising Sun better watch out. That's right, because I actually speak louder than words. Blah, blah, blah. Let's do this. Mick Foley trying to hurt me a little bit before the match starts. That ain't gonna happen. You know, I, I do that release German suplex a lot. I, I feel like it's very effective. Especially in... Battle Royale matches. Yeah, Tito's letting me beat him up pretty good. He's not reversing anything. I'm gonna, I'm gonna be a little risky here. I'm gonna go all the way to the top. Ah, oh, he's too far away. And Muda can't do anything. I guess I'm just having to get down. Get him before he can make a tag. Because I do not want to fight Mick Foley. I'm afraid that he would probably beat me. See if I can do a release German outside. There he goes. You would die. You would literally die if you were to jump from that height. I did not mean to tag the Great Muda in, but let's see what he can do. Nice. That was <laughs> that was pretty awesome. It looks a lot better on this, or a lot more death defying, because the character models are a lot smaller compared to the ring than they really should be in real life. Wow, he's counting really fast. I need to get back in the ring. Tag back in. Yeah, I'm hurting him pretty good. Let's get back in the ring, Tito. Let's finish this. Still have pretty much full health. Oh, wow, nice. <laughs> Wait, who's that standing on the way? Oh, that's one of the announcers. And then good old JR over here. Alright, if we can get Tito back in the ring, I can get a pin. I don't want there to be a count out, so come on. Get him back in the ring. I think he'll get back in. Let's see, nine. Yeah, he'll, he'll get back in. Okay, good. Because I would much rather pin him than have him get counted out. Let's see if I can just go for the pin here. Nope, not with Mick Foley <laughs> all up on me. This is actually getting pretty good. If this was a real match, it'd be almost pay-per-view quality. I can probably pin him now and be good. One, two, three. All right, we got it. Don't forget that ladder piece you hit me with. I didn't hit you with anything. Everybody knows that you could never beat me without it. Yeah, okay. That doesn't matter. Even if I did, I'm a heel, so I don't care. Let's see, Tito Santana's profile suffered. Mick Foley's upset he was barely involved, of course. The Great Moody is upset he was barely involved. Well, I tagged him in for a little bit. And Jacob Adams' status has not been affected. Tug Jeff Azero's association with Jacob Adams has had a positive effect on his agility. Cool. Kijimoto's stamina has improved considerably in we recent weeks. Sin Cara has been released by Rising Sun and must now make ends meet on the independents. Super Lucha Libre have crowned Jeff Hardy as their featherweight champion. Super Lucha Libre's ratings have risen to 90% since Juventud became their heavyweight champion. Interesting. 
And Goldberg's salary has risen to 9600 to match that of Kurt Angle. Interesting. Oh, and Jake Roberts has been released by Super Lucha Libre and is now in wrestling school. Let's see. Listen, I've been keeping an eye on your progress, and I think some changes need to be made. If you're not fit enough to give the fans their money, they pay athletes to go the distance. You've got until the fourth week of August to get your stamina up to 73, or I'll throw in the towel. Well, you can't fire me because I have ironclad, so doesn't matter if I do it or not. Don't you ever wish there was someone in your corner to guide you to victory? Someone has given me a cut. No, I don't need a manager. No thanks. I don't even know who you are. Perhaps if we can work together some time, I'll always have your back. Oh, okay, whatever. Cool. At least I know he's got my back. All right, we're going to end things with a tables and chairs match versus Mark Henry. Awesome. It looks like I got something to say. Or Mark Henry's got something to say. I never stopped dreaming of all the different ways to hurt you most, Jacob Adams. But then I realized I don't have to hurt you at all so much as the people closest to you. Oh, so you killed somebody, I know. Uh, you see, Seabreeze Sea will be in a hospital bed, and it'll be all your fault. I don't even know who Seabreeze is. You'll be in bed right next to him, Mark Henry. You're going to regret taking this to the next level. Darn right you are. All right, Mark Henry. The tug Jeff is zero in your corner. Big giant tug Jeff is zero. Oh, Mark Henry's definitely a lot stronger than me. So I have to try to outwit him. I think it'll be a lot harder to pick up, too. I want to get a chair, because this is a chair match. A tables and chairs match. And he keeps <laughs> he keeps taking the chair out of my hand. I, th I think I can get Mark Henry. He's already got pretty low health. And he just took the microphone from my hand. <laughs> that was hilarious. Let me hit you with the chair a few times. Weaken you up a little bit. Mark Henry's definitely weakened up. I think I can pin him at any point now. Just gotta get him back in the ring. Wait. Oh, wait, you can pin on the outside in a tables and chairs match. One, two, three. Oh. Not yet. Maybe I have to give him an RKO. And it'll be hard with Tug Jeff Zero coming in and just nonstop hitting me. Looks like he stopped, though. Eh, that's funny, the referee had to climb over. Yeah, I, I'm going to have to get out of this pin because they're not going to count it. Alright, let's get back in the ring. I'm going to try to get my adrenaline up a little bit. See if I can take Mark Henry out with an RKO. I'm just sitting here flexing in the ring. No big deal. Let's see if I can make him tap. Is he going to tap? Nope, he didn't tap. And they're chanting ECW for some reason. It's so funny that they have ECW chants in this game. All right, Mark Henry, let's end this. It's over. One, two, three. And that is all she wrote. I've won all of my matches today. Pretty easily, too, I might add. Uh, my profile has improved considerably by winning at a major event. Yes, it was a pay-per-view. My skill went down a little bit, but my popularity and strength went up, so that's good. Mark Henry's profile suffered considerably after incurring a major loss. And Tug Jeff Azir is disappointed that Mark Henry lost. And I have $3 million, so I really have nothing to worry about. Uh, we're running short of staff. Could you sit in on commentary for the next match? No, I think I'm done for the night. I don't think I'm going to do commentary tonight. I think I'm just going to call it on this video. These matches have been pretty long. Let's see, Chris Jericho has left All-American to pursue a career at Rising Sun. Great Muda feels great, is in perfect health. Great Kali has left Weekend Warriors to pursue a career at Super Lucha Libre. Mr. Fuji is sad that Great Kali has left Weekend Warriors. And Jacob Adams has been challenged to increase stamina to 73%. I don't think I have to. Well, I mean, I can. It's only one... Point. I do need better stamina anyway. It's getting really low. So I'm going to change the difficulty to very hard. So for the next video, we're going to have things be a little bit more difficult because I think hard has become a little bit too easy for me. So that's what we're going to do when we pick up next time. Well, guys, I hope you enjoyed this Wrestling Empire adventure. I think my videos from now on are just going to be month by month. 
I think this was a good one today. Uh, when we pick up next time, we're going to be on very hard, though. And I want things to be a little bit more difficult. I need a little bit more of a challenge, I think. So, like I said at the beginning, if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. It helps me out a lot. Uh, like the video if you like it. Leave a comment. Uh, let me know what you guys want to see. I, I do more than Wrestling Empire videos, too. And until next time, guys, peace.